Hello, what's up, ladies and gentlemen? How you doing? It is me, Lasty, here. Welcome today to a brand new episode of the FIFA 23 Ultimate Team Road to Glory. Episode number 125. Finger points to the sky. That is a quarter of the way through the next century of uploads. How quick has that flown by? Um, yeah, kind of nutty. I uh, hope you're all all right. Welcome to the start of a brand new week. Uh, it's Monday, so I hope you all reach your goals this week. One of my goals is to hit a certain amount of likes on this video. If you could help me reach 2,000, that would be amazing. Smash that thumbs up button. Team of the year is obviously well and truly underway. So, uh, yeah, keep showing that support. And thank you because uh, I see the numbers have been going up recently, and I, I very much appreciate that. So, um, obviously, subscribe as well if you're new to the channel. Uh, and we're going to get stuck into it then. So, you know what my team is looking like. It's like this at the moment. Um, I've currently played... My first five games a weekend league. I think I'm just going to get it up to 10 uh, today because there's so much more stuff for me to be doing um, that I will just, I'll, 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 I'll finish the weekend league in tomorrow's video and we'll do the rewards and whatever. But um, yeah, at, at the moment, I've still got loads of packs to open because, well, for those of you that have been watching the last couple of days, um, Saturday I did three lots of 83 by 10s, which were pretty cool. Uh, and then yesterday I did loads of packs up until the point where I had loads of duplicates and stuff. So I, um, what did I do? I stuck them into the 87 plus hero player pick thingy. Uh, and that was sort of like the main part of yesterday's content. Uh, and then today we're left with basically like the good packs, a couple of meh packs, but then a, a lot of very good ones left uh, here to open up for you lot. You know, 50Ks, 100Ks, jumbo, well, ultimate packs or an ultimate pack, and I'm, I'm going to be doing one of them 100, is it like a Centurion's pack or something? So, uh, yeah, uh, I think I've calculated roughly, I think it's a, a million coins worth of packs, probably a little bit more, um, but yeah, around the million coin max, so, uh, million coin pack mark. Uh, so, yeah, I mean, uh, no idea why that RB Leipzig badge was teal, by the way, like it was like a pro player or something. I thought I got something special, but obviously I didn't. Um, so yeah, there's going to be lots of uh, a decent packs galore throughout this video. Uh, and hopefully we can get something and turn it into something. Uh, some of the packs, obviously you can't really put a value on in terms of what they would be if they were like in the store. Uh, so I sort of had to guess, but I'm pretty sure we're around a million. Uh, which is very decent and quite, quite fitting because it gives me a good title for the vid. Um... So from a gold pack, we end up getting boards. Uh, I don't think I've cut any packs out here. So even if they're terrible, I'm going to show them to you anyway. Just simply because, well, the main part of this video is really a pack opening. And then the latter stages of the episode are going to be me just going into another five games of foot champs. Um, so the packs here I opened on Friday night. Uh, some of you have been asking about like saving up packs and whatnot. Well... I'm not one for that, really, am I? You guys know that. I, I saved for a week or so, uh, and then I wanted to open them up on Friday night and uh, in, enjoy. So um, I know that only attackers were in packs, and that if I'd have just saved these for a few more days, well, it would have been all gravy and would have, you know, had the opportunity to pack uh, all of the team of the year or whatever. Um, but those packs will come. Like, you know, I'll, I'll get more packs, whether it be through upgrades and stuff throughout the week. Um, this was a decent little 84 plus. We got ourselves a Harry Kane. Uh, and we're on to the 50Ks now. So uh, it would be nice to start either making some money if some of these packs are tradable or getting some good fodder. Of course, pack of the team of the year would be the very number one thing with the number two thing being packing a team of the year icon. Um, so Mascherano and Kane both went into the final part of this 100 players upgrade, uh, which is a, it was a Centurion's SBC, but it, I did it before it ran out. Um, it might even still be there, to be honest. And we've got... Oh, no, I think it is expired now, but uh, I'm sure probably plenty of you did it just because you had extra fodder going if you were doing all of your packs. I'm sure there are some of you still out there that are, are yet to open your packs. And uh, fair play to you. You have a lot better willpower than I do um, at, at storing those packs up. Uh, yeah, I guess you've got more of a chance of packing a blue. Uh, but anyway, we got a Stegen in that pack right there. We get a <coughs> Kingsley Coman in this pack right here. 
all right, fair dues. Um, take a couple of walkouts. And to be fair, when they're tradable, uh, a lot of the time, unless I really need them just to finish off an SBC right now, I'm going to list them up on the market because, uh, again, the I know a lot of people have been opening packs and like there's been a lot of store packs and stuff. Um, so the FIFA point spenders will obviously have brought some of the market down. But there's been a couple of SBCs which, um, while people's clubs are kind of empty, a lot of the... 85s and above are at a fairly decent price right now so i if i get anything of that rating and it's tradable it's time for me to cash in on that and actually take the coins because i've been pretty poor for a while now uh this is a jumbo rare players pack 100k pack and we only get an 84 kind of sucks to be me right there but uh, it is what it is. We'll take it and move on. I guess we did get this fella, uh, Kemen, who actually looks like a really solid player um, for what is a, a discard-worthy inform. Time for the ultimate pack then. It's going to be a walkout. What's it going to be, though? English. Right back from Liverpool. It's Trent. So that's lowish rated for if we're expecting to get lots of other stuff within it. But it's an ultimate pack. We got a walkout, so I can't complain. Um, there's 87, 85, 84. You know what? 10 duplicates as well. What else could there possibly be? Uh, not much really, but uh, time for this big one then. The Centurions 100k, no, 100 player pack. And we get an inform walkout and it's going to be Ramsdale. I was hoping it's going to be Rashford, um, but we get Ramsdale. All right, fair enough. <coughs> I don't think that really means much uh, uh, about like the rating of what could be in here. Probably can't get a team of the year though. Um, and it's all right, you know. We get an 89 Mane, 88 to Stegen, 88 Bernardo Silva, a couple of 86s. I'll actually take that, you know, uh, because I've opened one of these before and it was kind of trash. And I've seen loads of trash out there um, before. And you know what? I'll take it. We've got lots of players to go into our club now. Uh, and then loads of duplicates as well, which I can put into other stuff uh, or sell or list or put on the transfer list if they're tradable. Oh, sorry, once again for the... Uh for the, the break in, uh, or the transition in cameras there. I had, once again, a coughing, sneezing, spluttering fit for a moment there. Um, fun fact, can't currently hear out of my right ear because ears, nose, throat, it's all blocked. We're still getting over this, lads. We're getting there. I'm feeling so, so much better, by the way. It's just, um, yeah, wouldn't mind being able to hear out of my right ear. That'd be pretty, pretty decent, wouldn't it? Um, so... The next thing, what I was going to get onto before I spluttered for a couple of minutes was uh, uh, moving on to, I got marquee matchups done just because we've got so many players in the club uh, and I tried to put as many of the like 15 <coughs> to 20 duplicate untradables that we had from that Centurions pack. Uh, I tried to put as many of them into marquee matchups as possible and put the rest of them into other stuff like position modifier upgrades or whatever it may be. Uh, so these packs all have value as well that are all, all going to add up into the total of our million coin pack opening here today. Uh, Unai Simon is not the greatest uh, of players to get in a pack there, but we'll take a couple of 83s. You know, I could discard a whole bunch. My coin balance is slowly just starting to trickle in the upwards direction. We do get an inform here, so it does mean that marquee matchups is a profitable thing. Um, but unfortunately for me, it's a Norwich player. It's Timo Pukki, so straight to the bin with you, my friend. See you later. Uh, ain't no Norwich players staying in my club. We will take the coins. Thank you very much and move on. And uh, final pack, we get uh, another Finnish player, but uh, it is uh, going to be... Hradecki, Hradecki, however you pronounce his name. Uh, so yeah, right, we'll take that stuff. So uh, time to move on to the 10 coin pack. I don't know if it's still out by the time you're watching this, but if you haven't done it, might as well do it because you never know what you're going to get. It's like a pretty cheap pack, free pack from EA really, essentially. Everyone's got 10 coins. If you haven't, you're in dire straits and you need some fut help. So keep watching the series or maybe go back to the start of my series and watch that again. If you've got less than 10 coins, please. I can, uh, we can help. Um, so the coin balance goes way up as I list up those higher rated or players that had a value at the time, um, 84s and above, uh, that, that were tradable in my club. Don't forget, I've still got a load of these untradable in the club, which is great. Uh, and then I woke up on Sunday, which is when I'm filming this, and a few more things had sold. We're up to 250,000 coins. Excellent stuff. Considering we were way, way, way down and out. I had like 1,800 coins to my name. No, 800 coins to my name at some point. 
Um, once we'd finished Zidane or whatever, uh, that I I, I I was super poor. So it's nice to have a quarter of a mil again. Uh, and you never know what we're going to pack with the rest of this week. If we can get something good tradable, we could maybe increase that coin balance. Uh, or at least we've got a quarter of a mil that we could sink into the rest of a player SBC if there was something super valuable that I started but struggled to finish. You know how it is. So into foot champs we go. Now, I got beaten heavily, so I quit in my first game of the day. It was against the Sweat with a very good team, so I was, uh, you know what, I, I, I just thought, yeah, this is not going to go well, so I just quit, so I didn't make myself uh, get stressed or get into a bad mood. And then the second game, it took a long time to load in, and I and I saw that gold team, and I was like, oh, man, I'm against a hacker, aren't I? Um, but no, he skipped. He tried to skip. He had a triangle above his head, so he was a real player, and he was just someone trying to gift the win. So, uh Greatly appreciated. Uh, I'm glad I didn't just pause and quit there, but I, I made sure that he had a triangle above his head uh, and he was nice enough to give me the win. So I uh, appreciate that, my friend. Uh, and then we go into the next game right here. I go 1-0 up after 2 minutes 56 seconds with Divock Origi. Going to knock it through to the Belgian once again. I am still so sad he didn't get the upgrade because this card is phenomenal, man. This regular version is so good. A plus 2 would have been... Oh, like a tot boost or something for him. It would have been brilliant. So uh, I get a nice, easy 2-0 rage quit again. Like in a game where I had hardly any of the ball, I managed to just counter-attack twice and get two goals and he quit. And I was like, okay, thank you. Um, so yeah, I'm very glad I quit that first game of the day because it led me to getting a free, a free win and then a game where a guy quits after 2-0. And then this game, I think I go 1-0 up and he quits. And again, for the first five minutes, I didn't really touch the ball. This was our first attack. And uh, yeah, I mean, it's kind of lucky that it, it spills out to Alo Iran. Um, but at seven minutes, he just quits at 1-0. And I'm like, wow. That was three of the fastest wins I've had for really not doing a whole bunch uh, and, and hardly having the ball. So we get up to, up to six wins um, with just the one game for today left to go then, because I'll play the final 10 tomorrow, or however we, however many we need to hopefully get up to 11. Um, and we're, we're currently 6-3, and three, so we're either going to be 7-3, and three, which I consider very good, or 6-4, and four, which I consider okay. And uh, it turns out this was a... Uh, this was a really good attacker. This guy really was so fluid in the attack. I, I wasn't angry at it at all. I was just like kind of in awe of uh, my ability to not be able to get anywhere near him. And he was just passing it around so silky and stuff, getting into spaces to score goals. And I was 3-1 down at half time. I managed to score, so I sort of stayed in it for a bit. But I thought, well, one more goal to him and I'm going to be uh, royally screwed. So um, when I did a classic lasty offside trap, and essentially gave him a free goal. I thought, fine, cool, I'll quit at this one. You deserve the victory there, buds. Um, far better player than me. Really, really good attacker on FIFA, and I wish I wish I was that fluid in the attack. Um, so, yeah, here's, here's hoping I, I can get a little bit better. I have thought maybe um, about... Like, you know how we struggled in, like, yesterday's video or whatever it was about someone using one of their loans? Or a lot of people have been using, like, the loan icons and stuff uh, over the last couple of weeks because everyone's got so many in their club now. I wonder if uh, giving Pele a little go for the final few games or... or uh, what, Who have we got? Have we got... Have we got an R9? We Yeah, we have got a prime R9, haven't we? Um, so uh, I could potentially put a Brazilian icon in there for a little bit just to try and enjoy the rest of my games or something. Uh, I might do that. Uh, leave them so they've always got like one contract left. So I could play six games with, with uh, Pele and then six games with R9 or whatever. Um, yeah, I'll be interested to potentially do that. Um, and I might even, I might give that a go for the final few games of the weekend league. Hopefully not too many people just quit on me. I don't really like the use of loans in the weekend league, but it seems to have happened so much against lately that, I guess it's kind of accepted nowadays, so I might do the same. Uh, not like bombard it with an entire team of loans, but maybe just increase the old strike force for a few games. That might be quite fun uh, and it changes things up a bit. So we got a couple of half decent packs there towards the end. Uh, finished with my daily pack was a uh, was a Trent in the two player pack, which I was happy with, and then the eighty three plus attackers pack had an inform Hosselu, which was an eighty six inform. I'll take it again, uh, but yeah. We're now six and four in the weekend league. 
Uh, five wins to go. I need to go five and five in my final 10 games. Uh, I'll get that done tomorrow and it'll be pack time again. So uh, we've done a million coins worth of packs. We've got a few wins in the weekend league. Um, I hope you've enjoyed. If you have, do me a favor, smash that thumbs up button. I'd love to see 2000 likes on this episode and subscribe to my channel if you're new. Cheers. Follow me on social media, my Twitter, Instagram, TikTok down below. I've been trying to be a little bit more sort of like uh, regular and, and, and scheduled on there. So uh, definitely worth a follow and have a great day, everyone. I'll be back again tomorrow. I'll see you then. Peace.